Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Jorge Castillo, Dodgers beat reporter with the LA Times. I'm here surrounded by some of my esteemed colleagues, just wonderful <laughs> guys. Got here to my left, young Jack, Jack Harris. Ripper. Ripper. Got two columnists here, the two guys who give you the hot takes every single day, all day, every day. Uh, Dylan Hernandez and Bill Plaschke. We are here after game five of the National League Division Series. The Dodgers beat the Giants two to one. The finish was as thrilling as we thought it would be. It was an amazing game. What do you think, Bill? I think I got it right. I said they're going to, I said the minute they beat the Cardinals, they're going to win the World Series. So this is one step, but it was a taut, tense game. And how typical Cody Bellinger has had such a big postseason after, during the season, I said they ought to trade him. He was so bad. Comes off the big, the big single, Max Scherzer with a big save. The Dodgers are just, they've done this so many times before. They've been here. The Giants haven't. You can just tell. I mean, this team just reeks of championship. Yeah, you know, and uh, I don't know. To me, it kind of felt like the Dodgers unnecessarily complicated the whole thing by deciding, like, hey, let's take our starter who won game two and put two guys in front of them. And, you know, but, you know, because now, right, and now we, we kind of don't know the after effects of this. I mean, in theory, Dave Roberts said that Max Scherzer's, the plan is still for him to start game one. But, you know, he said we knew that if we did this, there might be a price to it. Um, you know, if Scherzer can't go, I think you do have to kind of start wondering, okay, was this the right thing here? That said, I'm not really sure it's going to matter. Yeah, I don't think it's going to matter either. Um, I think that they did what they had to do tonight to win this game. Now, you got to wonder with the whole not double switching when Blake Trinan came in and sort of using Trinan for just that one inning and then using Kelly the next inning, the spot coming up. You were kind of forced to use Max Scherzer there when maybe you really weren't. But it ended up working out. Young Jack, what did you think? It was a crazy series. I don't know how much more there is to add other than just, um, you know, I think one of the things that really showed in this series is how deep the Dodgers bullpen is. I mean, one of the reasons they were able to do what they did with the opener is because they have the weapons to burn a couple guys in the early innings and still have leverage guys on the back end, even when, you know, maybe you only got one inning out of Trinan and, and Jansen to have Scherzer come in and, and pitch the way he did. I think, you know, that was kind of one of the, I think the interesting things this year was seeing Kenley bounce back and some of the other guys who stepped up in the bullpen. And, and in this series, they all pitched really well all five games, which I think, especially when you start looking ahead and realizing how tough the pitching is going to be for them going into the NLCS is going to be pretty important. It's not, t I'm, I'm already bored. The Braves are boring. The ballpark's boring. Let's face it, we all, we all know this. The Dodgers are going to win this thing in five games or less. The Braves scored over 100 fewer runs than them. They won 18 fewer games than them this year. They're without their best player, Ronald Acuna Jr., or he's the most exciting player. I don't, and now they're out, they're out they're, Jorge Soleil is out with COVID. Yeah, all they got is that racist tomahawk chop that we're going to have Oh, to we're going to rip that. Oh, bring it on, man. The, yeah. the, 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 the tomahawk chop should be outlawed and banned, and if they start doing it, I'm going to scream at him from the press box. You know who one of the big defenders of the Tomahawk Chop was? Who? Dodger President Stan Caston. Was he? Yeah, when he was working with the Braves, he said, you know, that basically because it's not an actual Native American chant, that it was therefore not racist. Of course, if you use that logic, right, when Shaq did his, like, fake Chinese thing to Yao Ming, that wouldn't be racist either, so. It's actually funny, so before the postseason started, I asked a couple of people with the Dodgers who they thought their biggest threat in the National League was. Um, and they thought it was the Brewers. So the Brewers are no longer in this. Um, you know, I think the, the Braves are going to be heavy underdogs. Whoever pitches on game one, I don't know. Tony Gonson, they've been pitching this series. Maybe he goes in game one against the Braves and whatever. They'll, they'll probably figure it out between now and then. I just think the Dodgers, as, as Bill said, are going to be huge favorites in this series. They're just deeper. The pitching is way, so way deeper. So anticlimactic after this Giants series, yeah. too. So it just doesn't feel like the same juice at all. Yeah, and if that happens, of course, it'll be Houston or Boston winning on Bring the other side. Bring on the Astros. That'll be a series. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be the series. Yeah, but this one right here, this one lived up to all the hype. This, these five games, um, the series just went, just went down on the wire. Like Everything that we sort of thought about it, you know, how, you know, first time in history, these two teams, Giants, Dodgers in a postseason series. I mean, shoot, before the game, Vince Scully said it was the most important game in the rivalry's history. It lived up to the hype. It was like, it was an amazing series through and through. We saw drama here and there and everywhere. It was, it was a good time. And we could see this again next year and the year after that, maybe, and the year after that, you know. Um, strangely, I kind of think, you know, looking ahead, right, I, I'm pretty sure the Giants are going to be back at this point. I do kind of wonder, right, the Dodgers are going to have a lot of roster decisions. Yeah, so. yeah, the Giants will spend money this offseason. Ripper's not going to see it, though. Jack's not going to see it. You cover the Angels, right? Oh, yeah, because they're going to be in the postseason next year. Don't okay, worry. there you go. <laughs> You heard it from Ripper first. We'll, we'll see about that one. But, uh, guys, we'll, we'll, we'll see you guys from Atlanta. we got a flight to catch in the morning. Um, for Bill, Dylan, Jack, I'm Jorge. Thanks, guys.